What's up, guys? It's time to go get the new truck. Yeah, boys, so we just went and picked up the new rig, a new fishing rig to tow the boat with. But this thing is sick. Look at the screen. Dude, 12, the other truck didn't have inches. a big screen like Dude, that. Dude, that's bigger than the fish finder screen on our boat. How, how big was the screen on the old truck? Uh, it was, I think, like 7 inches or something like that. It's a 12-inch screen. Brand new truck, boys. 7 miles, as you guys saw it. Has 7.5 miles on it right now. Still got sticker on the window and everything. Got an adver advertisement. Literally brand new, brand spanking new. And uh, yeah, we're gonna drive home with it. This thing is sick. Ride smooth. And uh, I'll explain to you guys what everything it comes with. And uh, yeah, basically all the specifications of what's going on. We actually got a sunroof, moonroof with it. Nope. No, nope. you don't want it to go open. <laughs> the other truck didn't have a moonroof. It goes all the way back, too. That's sick. But yeah, you guys, we're going to fill it. They're filling the truck up right now with uh, diesel. Uh, and right after that, we're going home. We're taking this puppy home. And dude, this thing is so nice. It's got that nice new truck, new car smell. Man, this thing's sick, dude. Rides really smooth, but yeah, when we get home, I will get back on the camera and I'll show you guys what it looks hey, like. That was only an eight inch screen in the old truck. Eight inch? Yeah. Eight inch screen. That's a 12. Eight inch screen in the old truck. This is a 12 inch screen, that's sick. But yeah, when we get home, I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. I'm gonna show you guys what it came with, what the inside looks like, just a whole bunch of stuff. And uh, so yeah, you guys stick around, stay tuned. And, uh, yeah, I'll turn the camera back on when we get home. What's up, guys? It's the next day because yesterday it decided it wanted to downpour the whole time. So we weren't able to film anything yesterday, but we're back at it today. And, of course, we have the truck in the background. So we're just going to show you guys what all it has in it and the different things that it might have had from last truck. So, obviously, it's black. It's all black. Um, the last one was white with a, what was that color? Caribou. With a caribou, what do you call it? Second it's a accent or two tone? Yeah. Had a caribou accent, two tone, and obviously this truck is black. All black. No two tone, nothing. Just all black. With the chrome package. Show you guys. Got the chrome package on here. And. Took the 20s by 12s off the old truck and put them on this truck because why would you not put the chrome on the chrome package? That wouldn't make any sense. So, yeah. This thing looks sick. 14 wides uh, on the stock. <laughs> that actually has a lift on it. Those are 35s. 35s. Has lift. a ready lift on it. Suspensions. Ready lift suspensions. And as you can guys see, it's brand new. Obviously, we got the 6, 7 power stroke because... Come on, diesel's better, obviously. Come on. Well, in expense, <laughs> it's not, but hey. The difference between this year 
and the year we had, or the white truck, is it's a 10 speed transmission. Oh, yeah. The that one was one, six speed. Eight. Eight? Yeah, the last one was, was eight speed. Mm -hmm. Are you sure? It was eight speed. This is a 10 speed. Okay. And Ready? then it's got the 12 inch in dash screen. We'll, we'll get into all that when we get right. in the truck. I'm just going over what it has on the, the outside. This so. is a, the 6.7 is the, uh, it's uh, beefed up. It's got more torque, more horsepower. More torque, more horsepower, brand yep. new. Yep. Gotcha. So yeah, 6.7 power stroke. Um, best power stroke probably Ford's ever made. Well, Navistar actually made uh, 7.3, 6.0, and 6.4. So Ford is actually the, 6.7 is the first engine that Ford diesel that Ford has ever made and uh they're all all heard good things about them and they're all they've all been really good to us all the six sevens yes. so uh yeah they started six sevens from 2011 to as of now and we had uh, a six four it was bookie oh yeah that had a king ranch package in it it was, but a, king ranch, it was but a six four so you guys know six if you know what six fours are notorious for blowing up they're bad so uh got stock exhaust and everything on it got the def um tip nice and chromey brand new everything's brand new so it just looks good uh already got some dirt on it you already know <laughs> but good thing with black color is it doesn't show dirt as much as white so um that's a plus uh i've been trying to convince dad to delete delete his trucks but you know he's got to have the warranty to get a new one every hundred thousand miles so uh yeah you delete the truck you delete the warranty <laughs> <laughs> but it sounds super good but I mean, it's it ain't nothing worrying about that. Um, gas cap, obviously, diesel, DEF. That's where you put the stuff in there. Um, and uh, yeah, so got the chrome handles on the doors, opening the doors, and that's basically it. Uh, actually, this year, uh, Dad got an F250. The last truck was F350, so just a better towing package of the last year's truck. So, yeah, oh. we don't need that much in towing just a uh, right. uh, boat. So, um, yeah. so, yeah, that's basically what is on the outside. Backup cameras, everything. Got a camera for the windshield. Just everything on the outside. So, also, the outside has a moonroof all the way back. So, from the front, we'll show you guys that when we get inside. But from the front all the way to the back, even the back seats. So, yeah, we'll let that down for you all when we get in there. So, yeah, let's go ahead and get in there and show you guys what it looks like. All right, guys, we are inside the brand new truck. And as soon as you, as soon as you open the door, you just presented with this beautiful leather interior. King Ranch, this is King Ranch, this is King Ranch package. Um, they have platinum, what is it, XL, XLT, platinum. Lariat. Lariat and King Ranch. They have the new Tremor as well. Oh, a Tremor too, yeah, yeah, yep. I forgot about that. So yeah. Uh, me personally and dad, uh, we love the King Ranch. It's it's just really nice leather. It's that like saddle leather that you put on a horse, and it's just super nice. It smells really good. Get that logo in there. Heck yeah, dude. This is also King Ranch right here, center console. It's got that nice brown and uh, what would you call this color? Like a, I don't know, it's like a dark orange. I don't know. It's really, yeah. it's a really nice color, and it just matches everything. Ford did a really good job with this stuff. So yeah, so let's hop in and uh, show you guys what it's got. So you gotta hop in. Now. So give them a, a wide view of the dash here. This is the same from the last truck. Really good design here. Got the nice. Hit the hit the button. With the startup button? Yeah, just yeah, so, so you can get the... Oh, you're talking about this. There you go. Ooh, it moves you forward. Oh, yeah. It moves you forward to where you said it. Forward. So, this screen is 12 inches bigger than the units we have on the boat. Um, the last truck was 8, 8 inches. So, also a completely different design uh, here. Uh, last, last truck, it was just like a blue background. This is just a whole new thing, and it's just obviously huge you got your maps you got your phone right here if you want to connect to Bluetooth right here recent calls contacts you got your navigation and what was that favorite yeah favorite calls you got your apps right here 
all your apps, you got your settings. So literally everything, everything scroll through there. So yeah, that's the difference between this truck and the last truck. It has a 12 inch screen, and uh, heck yeah, dude. So, I wonder if there's. I wonder if this is still the sync system. I don't know. Because Ford used to sit. Uh, sit yeah, it is sync. S N S Y N C sync. So it is the, still the sync sync system. But the sync system on my last truck was like not updated, so it lagged all the time. So a really cool feature with this truck that we learned yesterday. Um, if you open this compartment right here, you open it up. That's your like charging station. So you got your USB right here. You got your new iPhone charging thing right here if you want to plug it in. Also, you got a pad right here. So like if you want to just, all you have to do is put your phone on it. Watch this. Boom. Charging. No, no wires, nothing. Nothing. Just got to put your phone on it and it charges. So that's really cool. Also, something new on this truck that I didn't see on the back, or last truck was this trailer backup. Is that a, you said that was a camera? Is it like that? No, that, like, that's an auto system. Oh, it's an auto system. You, t you t turn that and it, the Show truck, the, the, right the truck literally will automatically back up the trailer for you. That's sick. Yeah, that one on the last truck. That definitely got was. Four wheel drive. Yeah, obviously this truck is four wheel drive, four by four. So you got your twist knob right here for the four wheel drive. And, uh, so yeah. Oh, show them the moonroof. Put all that up, so this. just press that button right there. That pulls back the whole moonroof. That opens it right there. So, heck yeah. If you want to see the stars at night, you can. There's a the sky. How do you do all of it? You just keep you holding just keep it back? Holding it, yeah. Gotcha. So yeah, that has, uh, this is front seat moonroof, and then also, the back seat moonroof, back there. So this goes two different ways too. You can open it all the way, or you can just like do this, and it just opens the back. Oh, that's cool. Side, yep. Also, you got all your buttons right here, driver side buttons on the door, everything. Got your fans right here for air conditioning. Got the old stick for the shifting, park, reverse drive, manual. And uh, that's what the dash looks like. All right, guys. It's like a small apartment back yeah. here. So we're in the back. One thing that I really like about these trucks is when you got your last truck, um, so much room, dude. There is so much room back here. It's like it's just crazy. Like, like this is me with my leg room. Like, so much room. Like, it's crazy how much room there is. You got your fans right here for the back. You got your... Uh, Charging cords, charging stations for everything. Uh, obviously, King Ranch leather interior again for the back seats. You got your center console cup holders right here for the back seat, which we don't use because we're not going to eat in this truck. So, also you got your whole floor mat for the whole back of it. So the beauty also, of the beauty of this truck and the way I designed it, because you know nowadays you get on. Uh, you get online and design the trucks however you want them. So this is actually a mixture of a King Ranch and a Platinum because I got the Platinum panoramic panoramic roof in here. Oh, uh, okay. That's usually a um, Platinum kind of accessory. And then with the King Ranch now, you can actually, so it automatically comes with these like WeatherTech type mats and you can actually have the floor that same material. Oh, really? Yeah. So the whole truck has that same material flooring and then if you want to like go you know if it's time to go like prom style and hit the prom uh -uh. we got those snap-in carpets oh, yeah. that you can lay out and it's got the 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 ranch hand carpets that you can put in front and back oh, so, true that. really 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 nice option got your seat belts here safety obviously nice brown color that matches the seats and i don't did this did the truck have this set up this setup last time or yeah no? Yeah, oh, that it, was on the other truck. Yep. Okay, so the other truck did have this. I didn't even know about it, honestly, but uh, all you got to do is pull up on the seats. These fold back, and you got a whole compartment back here if you want to put whatever you want to put back here. You got a whole compartment back here. Yep. A lot of storage. You put your guns or whatever you want to do. I don't know. It's too bad it doesn't fit rods. Got a rods dog and... collar in here. And 
just you can put anything back here. So secret secret hiding spot for something. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Put your money in here. I don't know. Whatever you want, man. Whatever you want. That's it's it. your truck, so it's obviously sick, sick. Very cool, very cool. Yep, I'm digging the black this time. What? What? The oh yeah. I love black, black color. I love black, yeah. Yep. I'm digging sure. the black this time. So yeah, all you gotta do is just once you put them up, just pull them back down, and they go back down. So we're opening this inner console here. And a whole bunch of room in there. That was just like the last truck. There's a bunch of room in there. You got this little compartment just like the last truck. Money, little sense jar right here. You can remove it easy like that. And then you got a whole space right here. So yeah. Put whatever you want in there. That's pretty sick. Oh, that was the sticker. Yeah. So yeah. There that is. So that's basically the whole inside of the truck. Got a and got a I like these really what is that? What what is that? Is I don't that, know, man. It's really sick looking. It matches. It's on the door too. Crack that hood, bro. Show them that six seven. Show them the uh here. The reason I didn't some end cardboard up, back there already, bro. Oh shoot, I forgot there's sorry. Yeah. But uh I mean, you yep. guys can see it. it's just stock from the factory. The only reason I didn't get a spray and bed liner is that they told me that it would uh, delay the truck about three or four more months. Okay. If well, I got a spray in, so yeah, I can take it anywhere and get a spray in. So it came from factory um, metal. I think it, they all do, uh, unless you want it. I think these beds are still aluminum. Unless you want it. Aluminum? Yeah, I think they're still the aluminum. So dad's going to get a spray and bed liner. Uh, you guys, I don't know if y'all saw that on the old truck, but he had a spray and bed liner for the old truck. Um, it's just so it doesn't scratch up the actual aluminum paint. It's just more durable. And more durable. There you go. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it has this light switch, too. For at night. Just yeah. press this button. Got lights right here. Lights up the whole bed. Mm-hmm. And just turn them off. All right, so, yeah, that's the back. So, let's go Let's go look at this uh, powerful 6 set. Just lift up on this little latch right here. Got the old hydraulic system. Did you hear it? It was like, yeah. Sound like an alien ship or something. So let me go ahead and look up this uh, specs for this. But this is a 2022 6.7 liter power stroke V8 turbo diesel. And uh, here, let me look up the specs on it. What was that? Blow by. by. Alright, guys, so this 2022 6.7 liter V8 turbo diesel power stroke this has a whopping 475 horsepower and insane is what Google said 1050 feet pound torque foot pound foot pound feet pound foot pound whatever so yeah 475 horsepower and 1050 foot pound of torque so yeah this thing is a this thing's a beast it's a monster but uh heck yeah man it looks good. Job done. Oh, you think so? Oh yeah, it's sick. So yeah, that's what it looks like. Got the got one battery over. Here. It doesn't have two. Yeah, it has two batteries. Yeah, it's got dual. So you got one dual battery system. Got one battery over here. And you got another over there. Got your engine or your oil dipstick over there. Radiator fans right here, obviously. Got your coolant over there. That coolant reservoir. Why is my flashlight on? Got your intake fan, not fan, your, uh, what's it called, intake, but, yeah, that's what it looks like overall, coolant right there, got another battery right here, got a windshield, wiper fluid right there, the only thing I'm truly disappointed in on this truck is, I don't know why, but I, oh yeah, the don't lights. have LEDs, the last truck had LED lights in here, but, I don't know if that's a new know, had, like, DOT a thing, lights. like, I don't know if it's literally a, if DOT changed the regulations, I thought I had heard or saw something where they DOT recently changed the regulations and laws on LED lights, headlights. So who knows? But oh yeah, I can see it turbo. It's right there. Yeah, it's right there. It's this this pipe. Yeah, I think that's the up pipe is what that is. Yeah, that's your turbo. And then the down pipe is things behind it. But yeah, the turbo's right there. Yeah. Yeah, let me look up what the turbo comes with. All right, guys. So, it's, it said it was a uh, dual boost SST 
turbo kit. Just one turbo. It's not single. Twin turbo. It's just a single turbo. But I mean, it's. I think if I had to guess by looking at it, I mean, it's a big turbo. It's probably like a. Probably like a sixty. 65 millimeter turbo or 66 somewhere in that range I, I think I remember looking it up one time I think it said 64 millimeter turbo but correct me if I'm wrong in the comments but uh, yeah it's a big boy so once that thing spools up it's rolling from there so uh, let's cl close the hood and that it's a brand new truck for the PD fishing fam that's what's gonna be towing the boat. That's what's gonna be getting us around if we go on trips. It's like big. if we go back to Y'all Motor Ranch, or if we go back to Okeechobee, or if we go back, maybe if we go to Texas. I don't know. Speaking but, of which, should we get the boat hooked up to it? We should get the boat hooked up to it and see what it looks like. All right. For sure. Let's so, do it. Yeah, let's do that. There it is, boys. So it looks like with the truck on it. That looks slick, dude. That uh, looks slick with the black and chrome and the black and. Do we need to do that looks slick. green on the truck? <laughs> that looks slick, boys. Here, let me get. So it looks like right there. That looks slick with the black cover on it and everything, dude. That looks cool. Heck yeah, brother. Oh yeah, the old truck with the boat on it. There you go, that's what she looks like. That looks sick. All right guys, that is it. New truck, bye bye to the white truck. We got the black truck, all black truck. And uh, it looks really sick and slick with the uh, boat, the black cover on it. The black cover on the Mercury Pro XS. All black cover right there, that looks sleek but the truck looks really good it's got the chrome package on it chrome wheels looks really good it's gonna look really good while it's driving down the road let me know what you guys think in the comments comment down below tell me what y'all think tell me tell me if it fits i think it fits really well looks really good so thank you guys for watching this video make sure you hit that subscribe button and follow us on Instagram because we're doing a giveaway at 2,000 subscribers, SLXDC. So make sure you subscribe to our channel. Hit the bell notifications so you get notified when we upload. Go follow us on Instagram. See what, uh, actually going to be posting a picture on Instagram of the truck soon. So, yeah, you guys go hit the follow button. And, yeah, new truck, new arsenal. And, uh, I'm excited. I'm excited. What else is to come? It's going to be sick. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video, and as always, keep slapping.